I need to know the natural ways to induce labor at home. Wait a couple weeks. I'm already past my due date. What can I do? You do not need to pace around worrying about it, though walking around a lot can help the kid move lower down in the pelvis, which makes labor easier. I'm thinking more about herbal remedies. Stay away from the colon cleanse and castor oil, that may make your stomach and bowels move. But getting dehydrated is the last thing you need right now, though being really dehydrated can trigger labor. What about peppers? I know there are pizza places that sell spicy pizzas to induce labor, but I think they say that to sell pizzas. You could try sex. Very funny, but that's what got us into the situation in the first place. Siemens prostaglandins soften the cervix, which in theory allows it to widen faster and trigger labor. At the very least, you make your husband happy and enjoy things until you cannot for six weeks because you had a baby. What else can we do? There are midwives who say you can use evening primrose oil to help the cervix dilate, but it is downright dangerous if you have placenta previa. The sonogram did not show any sign of placenta previa. Some people try and black cohosh for that, but it is dangerous if you have a history of blood clots or liver disease, and it is not considered safe for pregnant women. That is counterproductive if you're using it to induce labor. You can try it for hot flashes, but not when you're pregnant, assuming you do not have liver problems or hormone replacement therapy. I do not need HRT, I have a kid pumping out all natural hormones already. One all-natural solution you could try is nipple stimulation. That reminds me of the guys who did the study on sex curing headaches, so that when she says she's not in the mood, she has a headache, for him to say that's exactly why they should have sex. This is not just an old wives tale or dirty old man story to feel a pregnant woman. There are studies showing that stimulating the breast for a long time causes oxytocin to be released. It just seems odd that all of these ideas sound like a great night out before having the baby. Maybe it was because these were study ideas for which they had no problems finding volunteers. I've heard that a big shock could cause a woman to go into labor. So either calculate how much college will cost for the kid in 18 years, or how much you'll have to pay for the delivery and first year in medical costs, your choice.